According to Pro Football Focus, Richard Sherman was the highest graded cornerback in the 2019-2020 season. He allowed only 8.4 yards per reception and one touchdown in 517 coverage snaps. PFF analyzes every player and every play to deliver their grades, not just the use of stats. So we are going to take a look at a few of Richard Sherman's plays this year and see why he is the best. So let's start with scheme. The 49ers base coverage is a cover three. This particular play is a variation of a cover three and they are blitzing. This allows Richard Sherman to play what I call a shuffle shuffle technique is with his butt to the sidelines and his eyes able to see the entire field. In a cover three, the quarterback is responsible for the deepest route that comes to him. This technique allows him to be in position to not get beat deep, but can be deceptible for deep comeback routes since he is coming off a torn Achilles. So Sherman is the smartest player on the field and because of that, he can jump any route with his eyes able to see the receivers and the quarterback, he can see the release of the quarterback and based off of his position, which is on top of this receiver, he knows it's, gonna, uh, it's going to be an underneath route and he can dump this ball easily and then do what he does best and take it to the house for six. Sherman's size and length still makes him ideal for a strong press player. His football IQ allows him to properly choose how to play the receiver after initial contact, depending on the play. He can stay on top, trail, or even still bait a quarterback. He can read the receivers well and basically run the route for him, as seen in the divisional playoff game against the Vikings, against Adam Thielen. Mm. The only thing Sherman lacks is speed. After tearing his Achilles, he's definitely not getting any faster. A quick receiver playing one-on-one -on -one with no help and a double move is the only way to beat Sherman. And the, uh, In the divisional round, Sherman reads the play and tries to jump a route, but he was wrong and just physically can't recover on this double move by Stefan Diggs. Luckily, the 49ers pass rush is the best in the league and gets the Cousins before he even has a chance to throw the ball. The last thing that makes Richard Sherman the best is his run support. I think the whole season he only missed one tackle, but that was an open field, one-on-one -on -one tackle with support behind him. On all his plays to come up and support the run, he was able to make the tackle or disrupt the play by taking on a block. He can uh, diagnose the line better than most DBs, as most DBs, specifically cornerbacks, aren't even taught to read linemen, but he does it so very well, he can come up on the run fast, and he is aggressive when tackling. Overall, Richard Sherman was the best cornerback in the league this year. He did not have one bad game, except for the Super Bowl, but at his age and the injury he had, he is still elite and has not dropped from being top tier cornerback in the NFL. If you like this video, please subscribe to my channel and share it with your friends. I will continue to make content like this as well as other closely related videos that involve football. Thank you.